Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, we started, bro. I gotta tell you this. Story. I'll cut it. I'll cut it out. No, I gotta tell you the story. What's that on that beat? Oh. Kyle wants to know if I was recording or not. Uh, What's going on, guys? Pro shop, but he's never been fishing yet in his life. Never, man. Never I'm been. scared to touch a fish, man. Yeah, I don't. I don't, like, I don't like touching the worm either, honestly. This is because when fish, there's sometimes when you touch them, they're like they come out with those spikes things, and then they just they slit you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're, they're, that's their that's their thin. Timsley is editing some PlayStation pictures. Um, trying to trying to get rid of the dust and stuff. He's, he's becoming a pro at it. Tyler, we got a couple packages going out today, still building the rest right now. We're gonna go ahead and go over to one of the photo rooms. The shelf's a little crooked though, we gotta fix it, but we got keyboards from Alton here, Synth stickers, it's cool stuff, some AA batteries too. Let's check out uh, new Synth Duracells. They are on sale never. Miguel Caballero. <laughs> um, I'm 23 years old. My name is Tyler Tinsley, also known as Tinsley, and I'm 22 years old. My name is Kyle. People know me as Kai in the Twitch community, but my name is Kyle. I'm 22 years old. <laughs> What's your name? We did that part. No, go again. <laughs> no, uh, Jake Bowden. 24, 25. 25. Are you Are you sure this time? Yeah, 25. Uh, when I was 10 years old, my uncle bought me a PlayStation 2 for Christmas with Ultimate Spider-Man, and I've been addicted since then. So, I used to play games a lot when I was younger. I had a PS2, and a lot of you guys, I don't know if you guys remember this game, it's called Max Payne. I played a lot of Max Payne when I was little. It's just what I played. And then I discovered what eSports was and competitive Call of Duty through Nate Shot on YouTube one day. And ever since then, i just been in the gaming scene, the competitive scene for Call of Duty, and that's just how I got my start. Hispanic, um, and uh, on top. Yo, what's going on? Oh, back in 2011, I was walking to the, 2009, I was walking to the mall. A guy was out there advertising for a Call of Duty tournament, so I went, I whipped some candy ass, I got second place. Didn't win, got second place. But, started playing in tournaments. Uh, the guy asked me to help him out with tournaments. Brought all my equipment uh, to help him run the tournaments, set them up, ran them, advertised for him, and helped manage them. And then he stopped hosting tournaments, so I took over uh, my own company a year later called MES Events, Michigan Esports. We hosted tournaments in Michigan. And still kind of do, but you know, COVID. For the last, how many years? Seven, eight years, doing uh, $20,000 prizes, $25,000 prizes, big tournaments with all the pro teams. Worked with MLG, Activision, Gears of War, Epic Games. Worked with all the big game developers. Uh, it's been a fun time. A lot of, learned a lot. But um, yeah, then I worked at Cinch Gaming for six years during my MES uh, tenure. And um, started my own company back in 2019 called Alt Customs. We make gaming keyboards custom gaming keyboards uh, over the next year was able to acquire and purchase Cinch Gaming and here we are now we got two companies two offices and a lot of employees League of Legends Valorant CSGO currently my favorite games right now probably be it to be Warzone Verdansk you know everyone loves that but other than that I'm probably with Valorant favorite game of all time though is CSGO can't go about it if I ever Locked to my keys in the car. I could use the scissors to like break back into the car. What? Optic gaming. Keep if it ain't optic, I don't want it. That's a hard one. Cause I'm a lifelong optic fan, but at the same time, I'm a huge in shop fan, so 100 Thieves has to be up there. But other than that, anyone else can go <laughs> himself. Oh, okay. <laughs> T1, League of Legends, and then Team Liquid. Because sometimes men are round. What the? Fetal. Uh, fetal? <laughs> it, that's yours. I that prefer to be on top. Good. So Kyle, we, we, we understand that you worked at Cinch for about two weeks and left. What happened? How'd you get in and so, what, 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 what happened to your exit? Okay. So everyone says it was two weeks, but in reality it was like a month, maybe two. It wasn't that short of a term. It was two I got in because I was getting into graphic design. Jake needed someone to help him because he was super busy with all the graphic design work, with the website, social media, everything like that. I came in, did about a week's worth of graphics for my two month span, and that's about it. I, all we did every day was get a little seizures and do one graphic for the month. 
to the night was gone. What was your favorite part about MES events? Uh... When they ended. <laughs> <laughs> Ha 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 ha!